Uh, welcome, uh, Marco Markula, uh, to Tallinn, to Baltic Sea Region uh, Innovation Camp. We are here uh, uh, three days uh, elaborating challenges, and, and this is part of the SMADER program. But at first, could you tell a little bit about yourself, I mean, your career? Uh, <laughs> the, uh, people? Okay, worked a lot with the university, although then being all my life, close to all of my life, uh, uh, and the politics. The time when I was a student, so I was elected to the Espo City Council, so Espo, my real platform for making new things to happen, and then very much on the, both on the Helsinki metropolitan region, political level, Parliament of Finland, eight years there, not anymore, and then on a European level with the as the president of the European Union Committee of the Regions, and now the first vice president there. Uh, thank you so much. I mean, uh, it's a great career. Uh, thinking about now uh, about this Baltic Sea and, yep. and, and smart up and innovation camps. Uh, so, how do you see the role of these innovation camps uh, uh, in this yep. uh, Baltic Sea development? Actually, the Baltic Sea region has been really the European forerunner uh, within the macro-regional strategy. And so increasing a lot uh, heavily the collaboration here locally, so kind of European partnerships, but especially taking into account how we can share knowledge, get the other things done, co-create something totally new, be like experimenting the future, inventing the future. And uh, on that, so this uh, innovation camp is a crucial one. It's a very good methodology so that bring people together for a quite short period uh, but like now in your uh, smart up so uh, very much the same people come together several times a year in different innovation comes in different uh, let's say working environments and that makes a lot of uh, sense so that share their experience because people have different cultural backgrounds business or scientific backgrounds they are different ages so then they kind of open create something new. Not to see this innovation camp as a problem solver, but really tackling the challenges, be more open-minded and then plan what I could do or you could do or the others could do to share and create something what we uh, are looking for, for what I said, inventing the future. Thank you so much um, uh, about these uh, 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 insights. Uh, how do we make impact then? Impact, actually, I think the key first is so that the people who are uh, reviewing and tackling these challenges themselves, they are committed. So they are kind of engaged on making new things to happen, but then they need to look who are the other key actors or actor groups, key persons even, how to get the others motivated. And I think this is really key on this so that we need to influence. And what I can bring to this experience from the political level, because uh, if the political level is not let's say first realizing the importance of this kind of work and then using the results in their own daily political decision making then nothing happens if people on the grassroots level make whatever nice experiments get uh, enthusiastically operating new results but if they don't get out from that let's say local box then nothing happens and that's why these different uh, levels of governance need to be integrated 